In fact, not only, I'm sorry, are these people changing what God is like, but they even go this far. That the Bible, it's only a rough guide. We need to go off the edges of the map to find new ways to experience the supernatural power of God. You see, when you hear that kind of teaching, it's a dead giveaway that one arbitrarily decides not to be led entirely by Scripture. That's the most dangerous thing of all. Uh, someone asked me a year ago, R.T., what would you like to accomplish more than anything else in the world? And I can answer that. I did then, I'll tell you now. You know what I would want to accomplish? I would like to leave a legacy that would cause people to turn back to the Bible and believe it, and believe it's true, and you'd be willing to die for it. God's Word does not change. You see, the ancient Gnostics, uh, they came into the church through the back door, and they said to Christians, what you believe is terrific, but we can make it better. And I'll tell you now, when one departs from Scripture to find new ways to experience what they want to call the supernatural, one is vulnerable to the power of the devil, because he can show up like an angel of light.